And you had a terrorism experience as well before I, this. I did. I spent nearly six years in the White House on the National Security Council staff as the director for combating weapons of mass destruction. And uh, prior to that, I was also in emergency response. So many of the attributes and the support that the Nevada National Security Site provides for radiological and nuclear response worldwide, uh, I happened to run those programs in the 1990s. We we're speaking on the 75th anniversary of the end of World War II. Yes. And it's 75 years ago in July, uh, this baby was tested or something like it. It's a, an auspicious time to be thinking about nuclear weapons and, and the state of the world. So maybe we could just speak in general terms of sure. uh, your your agency, uh, the NNSA, looks at I mean, one of its primary functions is non-proliferation. Right? Correct. So the National Nuclear Security Administration has three major responsibilities. We're responsible for the safety, security, and effectiveness of the United States nuclear weapons stockpile. We're responsible for reducing the threat of proliferation and nuclear terrorism around the world. And we are also responsible for providing militarily effective uh, nuclear propulsion for the United States Navy's aircraft carriers and submarines. Can you discuss in general terms the, the state of uh, concern about proliferation of nuclear weapons to non-state entities, rogue? Uh, organizations. Yeah. It, is, it is an absolute concern to us in the national security field. So we, as the NNSA or the National Nuclear Security uh, Administration, play a vitally important role uh, with our technical expertise to resolve any uh, proliferation concerns around the world. We're constantly looking to reduce uh, the threat of proliferation by securing materials around the world. Uh, we take back materials, radioactive materials from around the world on a regular basis. To date, uh, we have removed uh, material around the world uh, that could make up to about 300 nuclear weapons. And so we are providing uh, technical expertise and resource around the world for like-minded nations that are interested in reducing the threat of nuclear proliferation. And NNSA plays a centrally important role in that. And would it be correct to say that there are entities out there all the time trying to get nuclear material to create a bomb or a dirty bomb? There are uh, rogue states out there or rogue entities that would be interested in, in developing a nuclear weapon or a nuclear weapons capability. However, there are many, many, many more peaceful nuclear weapons or nuclear states that would like to use material in peaceful uses. And so where we can contribute to using uh, nuclear and radioactive materials in a peaceful form, uh, then we also advocate for that. But in terms of non-proliferation and counter-proliferation, we are basically the technical expertise that are resolving those crises so that uh, we can reduce nuclear threats around the world.